right now you probably are aware it's, it's, it's against the law for the, the government to share classified and threat information with the private sector. And it's, it's not permissible for the private sector to share that information, uh, information back with the, the government, otherwise they'd be deemed as uh, uh, acting as agents of the government. So we need to, to bring that, that barrier down. And uh, again, the EO um, addressed some of that, but we need, to, we need to bring that barrier down all the way because we need situational awareness. We don't, even though we're giving classified threat information to the private sector, unless we're getting information back about what threats or what attacks are actually happening, and also allowing that information to be shared uh, business to business, and right now, because there's antitrust issues we have to, have to be concerned about, um, unless we can have that full situational awareness, we're not going to be able to close that aperture of vulnerability down to a more manageable level. And we understand that because uh, cyber threats are an ever-moving target, and uh, the, the, the threats change constantly, um, and it's, it's difficult to keep one step ahead of the bad guys. We're never going to be able to say we are 100% uh, secure, but, um, but we can close that aperture of vulnerability down to something that is much more manageable than what it is today.